back for senior day in East Lansing. And they're not aware of what time it is. Tillman's got to fade away on the baseline, and he got it. What a shot. The energy was unbelievable. You know, we didn't necessarily know that that was going to be our last game, but what a way to end the season. The momentum was huge. I feel like everybody was getting on the same page. You know, as the Spartan away, it's towards the end of the season. We, we began to play our best basketball, but, you know, we felt good as a team, and we were ready to compete. Look at that look on his face as he comes down the court. Crowd is going absolutely crazy as the lead goes to 20. So it's a share of the Big Ten crowd for the third year in a row for Sparty. Well, guys, I have some somewhat shocking news that I am being told right now, and that is that the tournament, as of right now, and again, this is literally something I heard within the last 30 seconds, is being canceled. We had the bus loaded, ready to go, and uh, we kind of just put a halt on that. It was a weird time. You know, it was kind of like you didn't, you didn't really believe it was happening. You know, even though we didn't get to finish the season technically, it's behind us. It's a clean slate, new season. Um, I think we can take the momentum that we had from last season to bring it into this season. One word that's really been ringing in my head is just consistency. That's one word that coach has really been pushing with us. And you know, how consistent you are before the season starts determines really how well you're gonna play during the season. Our coaches and coaches though, did a great job of just, you know, making that vocal point to make sure that, you know, when the time comes, you know, that we're, we're going to be ready. We're going to put everything we have into control and what we can control. I mean, I don't know anybody on our team that, that isn't prepared for it, isn't ready for it. I feel Coach Is has been driving it home so much for us to realize that we have to bring our own energy, be our own lights. This is where team chemistry is really going to be important because at the end of the day, we only have ourselves, literally. You know, there's not going to be any fans in there. We're not going to have the end zone during the home game. So we have to be our own end zone. You know, we have to be, you know, each other's hype man. Honestly, we're looking forward to just being back out on the floor. You know, it's been such a long time looking back on it till we've played our last game, but really till we've been able to play anybody. I think a big step for me this offseason was just getting that confidence back. I'm um, just start shooting the ball like I know I can shoot the ball. Oh man, the work that I've put in, I've put in a lot of work. I haven't played in two seasons basically two years and so a lot of hours you know on my body a lot of hours on the court um, a lot of hours in the weight room i had so many different people around me just pulling me on because i i'll be lying to you if i said it was easy everyone knows the player that josh is and he's made such strides progressing from his injury that now he's full go 100 percent and just to have him back and uh and playing like the, the Josh that we know, it's been unbelievable just to kind of see the transformation. In times of adversity, people are made, things are made, and everybody's been growing, everybody's been doing well. You know, it's just a Spartan way of everybody not letting the situation that they're in or the circumstances that they're in define them. But looking into the draft opened my eyes to a lot of things, a lot of things that I can get better at. I haven't finished enough in college yet. There's still stuff that I want to do. I mean, I've been to a Final Four, but I never won one. And just playing with my teammates, my brothers, are like my family, you know, and just being there for them. It was a tough decision, but the process was everything that I dreamed of, and I'm just fortunate enough to go through it. Our freshmen have came in and done a great job of, you know, picking things up quickly. Um, Madi Sissoko, he brings, you know, a a rebounding, a shot blocking, just kind of tenacity to our bigs. Um, he runs real hard. Um, and then AJ, AJ's came in and done, you know, a great job of, you know, playing different positions, playing um, on the ball, off the ball. Um, and we're, we're really looking forward to kind of seeing what, what he's, he'll bring to the table. Each team always has their own personality, right? You know, you have the foundational principles that we play by, that's run, rebound, and defend. But I think this team's personality, I think we'll be able to score at a high level. Um, I think we have a lot of guys who can shoot it, a lot of guys, you know, that can score at different levels on the court. And I also think we have the potential to be a, a great defensive team. There's so many different things that this team can bring to the table, and I think across the board, you know, we're just really solid. A lot of people can do a lot of great things. Practicing against each other each and every day, you know, we have competitive guys and things like that, but at the same time, you know, we're really looking forward to our seven non-conference games. And then, uh, you know, with the Big Ten being as, as uh, loaded as it is this year, I think it's gonna be a, a really fun season in the Big Ten.